Hey TechRabbit here, and um, welcome to the channel. Um, so what do we do on this channel? Uh, we spend most of our time digging holes into different areas of tech, and um, so I just give a little bit of a rundown of what we've been accomplished in 2022, and then um, have a review of what the future might look like. So anyway, in 2022 we ah, transitioned to Windows 11, and um, we also um, continue in our tradition of acquiring new tools, workbench tools. Let's give an example. Also had a bit of a look at basic electronics in the whole series. Give an example of that also. So, resistance measurement, let's see if we... For example, this type of resistor. And then we can... Uh, started working on new ways to um, fabricate things, so... Um, spent a little bit of time on welding accessories and tools, and starting up with some basic welding. So we acquired a plasma cutter, but we didn't have time to um, <laughs> use it. The winter started, so that'll be upcoming um, content on that. Uh, also completed the uh, one of the first uh, major welding projects. Um, built quite a neat um, home lab rack, table, shelf combination. <laughs> Um, as usual, we um, focused also on the equipment used by the channel itself, so um, new PC accessories and upgrades. Had some observations on graphics card market, um, this is getting continuously better. And also in, uh, looked into alternative backup um, energy sources, so we got a petrol generator and tested that out. Renewed the grill. That was quite a little fun project. Uh, dual fuel grill takes both gas and coal. Um, had a little look at um, analyzing sponsorships um, from various angles. Upgraded the broadband to one gig, and then uh, we put together the the ten gigabit backend network. Lots to do with SFP plus plus modules and then um, also fiber, and then yeah, I, <laughs> like I showed in the um, short video bit that the um, the card has uh, because I opened the yeah like I said I op opened the case and um, and the airflow was reduced over the card and then the card overheated and then it deactivated itself. So that's why you have the um, driver here with comment with these error triangles. Anyway, so what's um, upcoming uh, 2023? Um, continue the tradition of um, acquiring new tools as needed. Um, basic electronics, we're going to probably migrate from analog tech to digital tech. And throw in some more content about microcontrollers, FPGA and communication stuff. Uh, welding, uh, accessories and tools will continue being um, in focus and try and make some more stuff for the channel and then see if we can use the plasma, uh, plasma cutter uh, in new projects that will probably be some new um, PC accessories and, um, and um, upgrades on the way 
and we might actually invest in expanding the home lab or up upgrading or improving it. And that's always interesting stuff to do. And on the software side, we're going to continue our tradition of looking into 3D, 3D design, software, PCB design, uh, some programming, utilities, and OS. Also throw in some general maintenance. And then, um, as tradition has it, we'll, if we improve the studio equipment or software, then we'll also um, document that. So the, the, um, if you are also running a YouTube channel, then you also get some feedback on what equipment works and what doesn't. And then, of course, viewer content and suggestion and feedback is always welcome. So if you have any ideas, throw it in the comments. We actually don't need any uh, external financing from sponsors or from you as the viewer, but any um, contribution will help. Maybe a cup of coffee from time to time. <laughs> Keep me awake. So, oh, see you in the next one.